Hello guys, welcome and welcome to Mitty Nursing Academy Daily Alert Explanation. The question is, a nurse knows that an infant with the diagnosis of hydrocephalus has a head that is heavier than that of an average infant. The nurse determines that the special precautions are needed when moving the infant with hydrocephalus. So, which statement would the nurse plan to add during the discharge plan? And here the right answer is option A, support the neck and head of the infant so what is the rationale behind this hydrocephalus as you all know it is a condition characterized by an enlargement of the cranium because of an abnormal accumulation of the csf fluid the characteristics causes the increase in the weight of the infant head the infant may experience significant head enlargement so always there should be a support needed when Picking up the infant, where the support has to be provided to the head and neck to prevent the hyperextension of the neck area and also the infant from falling backward. So, other golden point or the infant should be fed with the head elevated for the proper motility of food processing. Other point like helmet could suffocate an unattended infant during the rest and sleep times and hyperextension of the heads. That is, infant head could put pressure on the neck vertebra and causing injury. So, that's why we selected option A. Thank you, guys.